hi guys so welcome back to my channel it's another beautiful day and today is wednesday i had my surgery on monday so it is official two days post up um and it's currently seven in the morning i've been awake since six i think well it's been a night let me tell you because um we didn't go to sleep till like 10 11 or 9 10 11 and then I woke up at 3 and I was up all the way, you know, I got up and then was just walking around. Um, they went back to sleep at 6 and then the nurses came in to train me and and yeah, so then I just woke up. But today it's another new day and let me tell you that I don't feel no pain. Um, just a little discomfort, you know, just from laying on my back. Um, I do have the little pillow, let me show you. So I have the pillow, so like my butt is not laying on the bed, but I still kind of like worry, you know, because just I don't want to, I don't want to lose my my little fat cells down there. But my my skin feels like you know when you have a blister, you know how the blister feels with water, and then you touch it and it kind of moves like that. Well, that's how my body feels. I am ready for a massage. Hopefully after that, I feel better. I'm waiting to get showered and just change and just go on with my day because I feel like I'm wet from the back, like with a drain. But hopefully I could take a shower. Today is my first uh, massage, so I'm looking forward to that too. Hopefully after that I just feel better. Um, but yeah, so it's just another day. Um, Louis over there. <laughs> he's over it. He, he's ready. Um, but, yeah, so I'm just gonna bring you guys along my day, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and as always, if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you guys can be part of our family. So, let's go. Alrighty guys, so our breakfast is here, and I'm already tired of laying down, so I'm just going to eat standing up, but we got some, what is it, pancakes? Pancakes with blueberries and a little bit of cilantro. <laughs> just kidding, I don't know what that is. Poly mint and then some eggs. Got my apple juice and the pills. The pills. The happy pills. Just kidding. <laughs> but I guess I'm not gonna be able to shower till after the massage. Um so you know because they're going to drain you and then the oil and you're gonna be super sticky and all of that so I guess they wait afterwards. So I'm gonna be going over there a little stinky. <laughs> all manchada and everything, huh? You've been farting all <laughs> Stop <laughs> see that. Dude, let me tell you, yes, you know you get very gassy, but TMI, you're not able to go um for you know because of all the medication and stuff. So I'm just still waiting. I'm still waiting to go. Uh, I feel like if I go and try maybe I Oh my god, this is too much. But I'm just gonna wait. I'm gonna wait till after, I guess, the shower and see if I can try and do it. But for now, we're just going to eat the blueberry pancakes, take the pills, and yeah. And then I'm, if I'm, I'm able to stand up a little bit more straight, but the doctor suggested not to do it yet, just because you know everything over here is super tight. So if I pull um, more than I should I could actually pull a stitch out so yes yeah, so I'm taking it easy you know no need to rush but we're just going to have our breakfast and then yeah and it is super windy today cold hey guys so it is currently 3 40 I just came back from my massage and let me tell you that oh, I feel so relieved um it actually felt pretty good it's like I don't know how to explain it but it just feels really good so I'm glad that's over my skin feels tight again well not again but it feels tight you know because before it was like a balloon like you know like a water balloon but now it just feels good so I'm just going to lay down for a little bit because I did get somewhat tired but I'm going to get in bed and this is a mission to get in bed it is a mission huh mm -hmm. <laughs> can you get the little stool so, so tomorrow I go back for the massage again and then I go 
Friday and then we go back home. So I have to find someone. Oh, you know what? She was gonna give me the information for someone. She didn't, she didn't give it to me. Mm -hmm. well. So I have to find someone. Over there. Let me get in bed. Hey guys, so I just got out of the shower and I feel so clean. I didn't wash my hair because let me tell you, I didn't bring any of my stuff in my hair. Um, so that's okay. So I'm gonna have to wait until we go back home. But I'm just wearing my side foams now and the backboard. So this is what I'm looking like right now and I feel so much better because, you know, like all the drain was getting on my back and I feel like sticky and nasty, but now I feel so nice and clean. Guys, good morning. It is the next day. Hey guys. So it is currently 5 o'clock. Um, our morning went by pretty fast. I went to my massage and then I went to see the doctor, you know, because I am leaving tomorrow like I mentioned before. Um, so everything is good. Uh, the massage this time it was a little bit more uncomfortable than yesterday but i think it's because my i'm getting my sensation back so i'm getting to feel you know everything else but it was more like you know when you work out and you're sore and then you go with like a rolling pen you know like um you know to to loosen up the the soreness you know like i don't know if, uh, i don't know if that makes sense but yeah it kind of feels like that like when you're it's stretching when you're stretching you know after working out that's what it feels like um but other than that it feels it feels so good when you're pressing on you know your stomach and your back and your sides it just feels so good for me because i just feel relieved um but yeah so i just took a shower too you know because after the massage like you your body's really nasty um but yeah so the doctor he saw me he said that I'm looking pretty good. Everything is healing. And let me show you guys. Right now I look very um, bulky and and bigger, you know, because I'm wearing the foams. I'm wearing the side foam, the back foam. And yeah, so I'm just surrounded by foam. So it makes me look a little thicker. But I am loving the results. I am going to go down 20%. But you know, that's natural. But let me show you guys. Just a quick show this is what i'm looking like so far so you can't really see much come in but yeah so we had um lunch and it was actually pretty good we had like um bistec with green spaghetti no, it wasn't and then some vegetables it was really good because it had it had flavor you know it was good and then when I came back from the appointment, we had a snack, which was like a fruit parfait. It was really good today. Um, but yeah, so we talked to the kids already. And now I'm just uploading my stuff so we can upload a video. And then, yeah, I could just lay down, relax. Tomorrow I have my last massage. And then I have to find someone to do my massages once I'm over there back in Arizona. Um, because, you know, the first week you have to get them every single day. So we have to work on that, but I am excited tomorrow. Finally get to go back home, sweet home. So Louis is very excited too. Mm -hmm. It hasn't been bad though, right? Mm -mm. It's been like a little honeymoon, yet no honeymoon. Yeah, <laughs> He no, gets to, no honey. <laughs> he gets to, you know, put my socks on and I mean, you know, he's having, oh, and a quick update. I didn't, I did not get a suppository. I know TMI, but I did it. Um, I actually went by myself, so it was pretty awesome. It's crazy how exciting that can make you, you know, when you're going through tough situations. But yeah, so we're just going to finish up and then yeah, get ready, lay down. And yesterday we ended up going, to, we played a movie and then I ended up falling asleep and then i was up super early so we'll see today we have to try to stay up a little longer okay so i'm not going to sleep early mm -hmm. hi guys it's another beautiful day and today is post op day four um and we're ready to go home and so i have my appointment at 11 o'clock for my massage and then after that we're gonna get picked up and then get transported to the airport so we can go home uh, our flight is not till like 4 4 30 huh? or 3 30 so wait so how so that we should be in arizona at 3 30 4 30 
Uh, well, yes, yeah, so I'm excited well, to go. Four thirty. You told my mom. You told my dad at six thirty. Well, we get there at six thirty. Oh. So yeah, so I am excited. I feel the same. Um, you know, just uncomfortable, but all the boards and stuff is squeezing me, so it makes me feel like out of breath. Um, but yeah, so we're just getting everything ready. So like that, once they come to pick me up for the massage, we have everything ready, and then from there we go straight to the airport. So I'm excited to go see my kids, even though I don't think they are excited to see us. Um, you know, because they've been having a good time without us, but I'm ready. <laughs> I am so ready. Alright guys, so we're just here waiting for our driver so he can take us to the airport. Oh, uh, let me tell you. I feel so good though. Like, so relieved. The lady that does the massages here, it's amazing. It feels so good. So we're just waiting. And it's a little cold over here. But I'm really covered. Came prepared. Alrighty guys, and just like that, we are here at the airport now. Ooh, what a drive <laughs> alrighty guys so 10 minutes later took us longer this time because of the foams and the drains and all of that but we're in um, and it was more busy it's because last time we were the first ones remember so yeah so this time it took us longer but we're here so now we're just going to fix our stuff and then get some water because I'm thirsty okay guys so we have like about an hour and 30 minutes before we Go to the airplane. <laughs> <laughs> so we still took us some food. Not the healthiest. Uh, you gotta, cool, right? you gotta change your ways. <laughs> this is mine? Yeah. So I know I won't be able to eat all of that because that's just too it's much. Okay, I'll be bit starving for a week. I know. And then he got a sandwich over there. The last time we had it. We're good. So the last time. You know, we, ha we were here, this is the same thing that we ordered, so we were like already thinking for oh, five days on this food. So good. For me, a lot of protein, a lot of vegetables and stuff, but... Okay, I'll take some of your meat. <laughs> so good. Okay, so I had to sit on my knees because I just couldn't. But we're done eating. You enjoyed your meal? Yep. Here, <laughs> <been> a minute. <laughs> no, that's fine. I only eat half of the meat. That's it. Apple juice. No soda? No <laughs> lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> we are almost there. <laughs> so you gotta walk all that. You have to get to the other side. Let me tell you that I got my workout in. We were like at the end, at the end, how we were at the end? We were at the end of the airport. So we're almost there. So we have about an hour before we can board the airplane. So we're just going to stand here and wait. <laughs> <laughs> That's not so bad, huh? Well, I mean, honestly, I mean, I'm gonna be sitting there for an hour, so I'd rather just stand up and Lovely. save my energy. <laughs> It'd be so cool. Huh? It reminds me of the Toy Story movie. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Like Toy Story. Are you serious? You don't see it? So we're just going to wait and then go home. Alrighty, so finally time to board. Hey, we see it. So where you at? So where you at? So we are in the plane now. And we're like in the very, very truck. So hopefully it's just a smooth roll. Like last time. Last time we were like on the other side. But here we go. Sitting in your little chair. You can see it. I'm ready. I'm ready to go home.
wasn't that shaky, huh, buddy? It wasn't that windy today. <laughs> miss my home I just missed everything but I am so thankful to be back my princess oh. I have this is the first time that we have ever 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 left them for that long um, so it definitely you know it was a little selfish of me but I'm back so thankful Gracias a Dios that everything came out good very thankful with my sister-in-law that you know and my brother that they took good care of my kids so everything was good, everything was good. This whole experience was, honestly you guys, very good. Um, you know, everybody in Mexico is amazing from the doctors, everybody, all the ladies at the recovery home, they were amazing. Um, so I'm just so blessed, so blessed for everybody. All the new people that I got to meet and just, you know, this whole journey, it has been good so far. So of course, you know, I still have probably I mean, I don't think it's the hardest part because I already did the hardest part. But, you know, now it's just recovery and then let my body heal. Definitely have to, you know, change some ways, the ways that uh, I used to eat. Um, you know, just portion control and, yeah, eat a lot of more vegetables and fruits. Um, but, yeah, I'm excited. Obviously, working out, you still, I still have to work out. Uh, even, you know, this is... This is honestly, you guys, not an easy way out because it is, for one, painful. Not painful, but it's just, you know, like, it's just a whole journey. And also, it's expensive. Um, and it's just emotional and physically and emotionally hard, okay? But, yeah, overall, I mean, it's good. I mean, I'm just happy I did it, and I'm so thankful that I did not... Um, get any of those how do you say it a bad um, no because you know I, I I was watching a lot of videos and I was watching every a lot of girls experiences and a lot of them were not a good you know not good they were in pain they were um, they just have really bad experience um, but I'm just so thankful that my experience was different and like I said, you know, everybody is di everybody is different. So of course, my pain tolerance is not the same as yours, or you know, anybody is just different. We all feel different. Um, but overall, I'm happy I did it. I I'm happy to go through this journey. I'm very thankful with Louis because honestly, without him, you know, this journey would not be easy. He has all he has a big part to do on this, and I'm just very thankful for him. But now, just recovery. Uh, doctor, you know, Dr. Campos, he is amazing at what he does, honestly. I'm just so happy that I went with him, and he's just amazing. He's an amazing person, amazing doctor. And, yeah, from the moment I walked in into the office, you know, and he greeted me, and then we went over everything to the moment, you know, to my post-op appointment. He was very professional. He was just amazing. He's amazing at what he does. He knows what he's doing. So I'm just so happy that I went with him. And I waited, you know, and just went with him because he was amazing. Like I said, the ladies at the recovery home, they were all so sweet. Even everybody at the um, doctor's office, they were so sweet, so nice. Um, so I'm just so thankful that I went with him. And, yeah, so now we're just going to recover. I have to figure it out, you know, how I'm going to sleep here because, for one, I did not prepare um i did not prepare like buying you know like i have a whole bunch of pillows but i did not prepare like finding a way of sleeping or making my own bed here so that's not what we're that's in that stage that we are on um so yeah we'll see we'll see how it goes tonight but i'm just happy to be home so happy <laughs> you're happy mm -hmm. yes so now we can go back to our routine because this week, I mean, was rough. But it went pretty fast too. And and I got to flight. <laughs> yeah, that was 
that was something let me tell you but it was an experience and yeah so now i'm just going to figure out how i'm going to sleep <laughs> that was the whole thing about this yeah i know but overall and, oh and my mom and my dad um you know they didn't agree to it but they didn't say anything i, I was surprised because i was already prepared to hear my mom's uh you know uh my mom's what is it lecture but yeah she didn't say nothing uh you know she just says she didn't agree to it but hey what can she do anyways i think we're just going to end the vlog here uh let me know if you guys have any questions i'm going to be you know obviously vlogging this next days of my recovery and just everything so let me know if you have any questions and leave them down in the comment section and yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed watching today's video and as always if you did make sure you give me a big thumbs up if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you guys can be part of our family. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on our next video. Bye! Bye.